Good morning, Moss Warriors. Today is Tuesday, October 10th, 2023, and today is Walk to a Park Day. Public parks and green spaces are a community backyard. They offer nearby residents a place to play, connect, and reap the benefits of the outdoors. That's why National Walk to a Park Day on October 10th encourages us to walk to our local parks. Feel the wind on your face, take in the fall weather, visit with neighbors, play with your children, and appreciate all the benefits green spaces offer communities. Parks are an essential part of improving public health. They provide a place to play, exercise, and commune with nature. They support equitable and thriving communities, and they protect communities from the impacts of the climate. Yet, 100 million people, including 28 million kids, do not have access to a quality park within a 10-minute walk from home. National Walk to a Park Day is not only a celebration of green spaces, but is a call to action for cities to ensure everyone across the U.S. has access to a quality park within 10-minute walks of their home. As part of this National Day, walk to your local park, encourage your community to support more public parks and green spaces too. Now, Liberty, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Mossville Pledge. As a Mossville warrior, I pledge to do my best today and to be the best I can be. At Mossville School, I am respectful, responsible, and safe. This is the warrior way. This week in our Lions Quest program, we will focus on recognizing our stress levels and developing strategies for managing stress in healthy ways. Our quote this week comes from Rashika Jean. I can only give my best to others when I am in touch with the best in myself. We are definitely not our best when we're stressed out. Learning how to manage our stress helps us feel in control of our lives and to make healthy, wise decisions for ourselves and others. This week, pay attention to when you feel stressed out and find one quick way to calm yourself. It might be taking a few breaths, going for a walk, or spending time with a pet. Whatever it takes, practice managing your stress this week. Your body will thank you. Daily reminders. We need to make sure we're bringing our lunch cards to the cafeteria each and every day. We need to make sure we're getting to class on time as our tardy detentions have increased. And make sure you get those assignments turned in so we can avoid all zeros. Parent-teacher conferences are coming up in two weeks, and we want to make sure that all our parents are getting good reports and proper feedback. We do not have any birthdays today. Congratulations to Miss Moreland's class for having the best attendance this week. We appreciate all the students making the effort to be here each and every day. Congratulations to the Mossville Warriors girls cross-country team for placing third in their sectional Saturday and advancing to the state meet this coming Saturday. Congratulations to Brody Miller for qualifying individually and advancing to the state meet Saturday as well. Way to go, Warriors. This day in history, on this day in 1899, American inventor Isaac R. Johnson patented the bicycle frame. Activities today, we've got cross country, girls basketball, and speech practice all after school. Hot lunch today, we've got mini corn dogs with pretzel rod, cheeseburger, egg roll in a bowl, or sun butter and jelly. Our sides are broccoli or baby carrots and diced pears. And remember, it's a great day to be a warrior.